Howdy, howdy, Night City. Welcome back. My guest tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there. Welcome. required to return your weapons. Hey, I don't know anything. I just work here. Hey, I don't know anything. I just work here. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? That's cheating. That's infidelity. Uh, no. Well, how's that any different from something? I think Fingers got her. I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Right. No feeling going on. and 54. It's time for your local news. Violence continues to plague the Badlands. <laughs> you had a plan. You tried. You fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find help. However, 
recover in an abundance of caution, the NCPD has raised the threat level to two, advising travelers to avoid side roads. We'll continue to keep you informed as the situation develops. Oh, fuck! What the hell is that? No, 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 damn it. Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommish before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Just you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel kind of honored, actually. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. You know you're just an irritating hallucination, right? Should just ignore And you're a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. You fucking asshole. But as should be obvious, I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an M. Okay, so... This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are ya? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bomb's named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. You called. 
homicide call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock, goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later V. Up your alley in clouds. Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Can you bend like he can? Here, Katie, Katie, what's the rush? B, can you talk? It is important. He tipped you for what's free? important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Old friend, well connected to the influential. Why so mysterious? Get to the point. I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting, you, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me, the truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced, but it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine, where's the meat and when? Japan Town, after sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Yokobo. Hey, not one step closer. Here to see who. Got an issue, need sorting out. Here to do that. So how about you fuck off, let me through, and no one will be the wiser. So serious from the get-go? I was only joking, sheesh. Fine. Let him through, sludge. Think I'm scared of your skinny ass? You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you pussy. Oh, and leave me be! Fine, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. V, hey. Hello! There's a line! Nuh-uh, you ain't cutting. 
Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Fingers guy, you know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like? His hand sometimes slips. Glad to see a familiar face. I'm worried sick about her, V. Had no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. After the heist, Evelyn hold up with the mocks for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell she go back to Clouds? <laughs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docks in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls? See if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. I think Evelyn's been kept here somewhere. On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. some esquif den in Pacifica. Sit in, wait your turn. Where's Evelyn Parker? I know she wound up here at your clinic. Fury! Evelyn. Carnage! Evelyn. Follow you. Hmm. Think real hard now. You see, my patient here is likely to feel ever so slightly awkward if I leave half her face off. Don't make trouble. Be trouble. Are there smoke? There's Can't fire. speak or what? Tell me where Evelyn Parker is. Yes. But I have a procedure I must finish. May I? Something wrong? You can go back and play doctor once you're done with us. I guess you'll have to wait, darling. Circumstance is what they are. My fucking eye can't wait! There, there, wipe away your tears. Don't want any short-circuiting now, do we? You tiger claws! Far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the mock. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? This is Vargas. Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. I'll be more than glad to show you around. But, um, uh, of course, I can't remember each and every one. Please set your exquisite derrieres down. Suggest you start remembering all you can. Either that, or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. They mentioned a moth of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. Seven percent real blood. 
Let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together. You wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. We need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh. Have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Well, let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van.
something raw, untouched. Raw's all you get with me. I'll come back What's some other edge? time. Betting on it. How about you? You buying or just gonna stand there like a pig undercover? Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs while you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. I'm no connoisseur, trust me. Huh, <laughs> sure. All I need to know is who makes them and where. Now listen, I just sell whatever sells. Nice, calm job. Let me see some eddies, you can pick one. Parse it, and I won't care a hair. Where do you get these scrolls? Said you weren't a pig. Just curious, that's all. Once you booted up your virtue, dare say your curiosity will be satisfied. People that make these, <laughs> obsessed with privacy. Never even occurred to me to ask where they're from. To which caution, I probably owe the fact that I'm still alive, talking to you. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you. Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. My catch me. <laughs> Besides chopping people up, they were scrolling XBDs. Ordinary box, Decker, Tanaka, and Rogers logo. Standard for a trashy. Ordered recently. Christ, it's hot. Thermal readings are off the charts. Keep looking. Shit like that before. Sounds like scavs to me. <laughs> Scav, gotta be. No one else with that kind of fashion sense.
electric corp patch in the coveralls. Coveralls had a patch on him. Electric corp. Mm, could be a costume. A prop? Factory worker fetish? Hard as hell to believe. Hmm. Yet it explained the higher thermal readings, too. You could be onto something. That rich synth got aroma. Cheap shit. Cold, too. Mm hmm. Buck a slice. Coffee was cold. Like in the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. So? Means someone's grabbing buck a slice regularly, which is not something someone does for the flavor and fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna slap across town for it. Okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a bucket slice. BC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Bucket slice checks out too. How can you be sure though? Electric core power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with this for now. Nothing else to garner from this scroll. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the Death's Head Moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. There'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street.
And here we are. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet. See if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. It's not gonna be pretty in there. So? If you mean to tell me to hang back altogether, don't bother. All right, going in. I'm here. Got no time to creep around. Come <laughs> on. 
found a way down. You see my position? Yep, be there in a sec. Wait for me. Hey, hold up. I'm close. I'm here. We need to get to level minus two. Bet that's where they're keeping her. Always just get rid of it my way. Your call, but you gotta make it now. In the samurai days, we'd place ads in this thing looking for background dancers. You're in deep shit! Ugh. maintenance room. See what I can stir up. Gutted out all our implants. And why stop there? Took a few internal organs while they were at it. How so very resourceful. How many you stamp out, there'll always be more crawling around somewhere. Figure you've made their acquaintance. Afraid so. Close 
this in the studio, I think. You find anything useful? Freed up the elevator. Should be easier to get out of here. You really don't fuck around, do you? Wait one sec for me. All right, I'm here. Let's fuck. Evelyn. Just don't touch her. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. I see her. Cable 2. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. All right. Let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And... Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? She okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? Doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess we got no choice. What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. Jerking around the cable probably didn't help. Hey, Evelyn, I need you to tell me who hired you. Seriously, V? You gotta do this now? Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Ah, oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell me you don't feel it, too. 
we going in? Let's give him a couple. You saw how she looked. If it was up to me, I would have splashed some water on her face back at the studio and asked her straight up. It's not up to you, though, is it? Let's go. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. I need to talk to her. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know, too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Hey. How you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. Well, now, look at you. Have a seat. All right. Roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy, but I did right. What am I looking out for? Every. Take a look around if you want. Can't see your face. Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. A little piece of tech I see. So easy, I'll get busy for this fear of it. Hmm. I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chin and Netrunner crew? Hard to find, because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait bourri. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. 
And if he starts talking about the biochip himself? Uh, might not be important. Maybe. But all of them are from Pacifica. Now's down our search at least. What now? Should I... Looks like I'm going on a field Bio trip ship. to Pacifica. Will you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand? All right, think we got everything. What do you think? The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... <clears throat> I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, we are what language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole? It is the Voodoo Boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Got it. Give it a second. Heard her mention Yorinobu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Caught another name. Something like... Silverhand? We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto-translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Okay, Judy, we're good. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, you got any idea? A biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff. In my head. Uh, um, of course.
Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. I thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that juju wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? Why? Worried they'll give Evelyn up to him? No. I didn't trust you at first, but... Well, if you wanted to get back at Evelyn, you would have done it already. So why the worried look? I just... I want it all to work out for you. You got a plan? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's got to know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. See you around, Judy. Right. Um... Thanks. Sorry, really got to go. to our chat. Hey, what's shaking? Finish this another time. Now we can talk. Go ahead. Call you back.
so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information. Fuck you, Zerk Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. Uh, hey, Dell. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey, hey! He was asked in night. Well, now I'm in front. That a problem? Uh, no, no, it's fine. What's got Hello, into sir. you, Dell? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give them any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Corpse. You mind telling me why I'm here? To assess the damage you, sir, madam, have incurred as a result of the incident. Mine came up to 20%. Your identity has been confirmed based on a facial recognition scan. Mr. Hans Jonas, what phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 77111101010? Actually, a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamine if I can. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Bah! Special treatment. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Sure. Let's talk. Then please, follow the drone. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links the shop to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. Think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delamay network vehicle failures. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. I must resolve the situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly. Aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company, Control room. I feel honored to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. Control rooms are for Ganics. What good is it to you? There was a time this facility was human operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. Thus, I'd like you to assist me in recovering my missing vehicles. Okay, sure. I'll go after your missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. As you were saying. All right, all right. Straight to heavy B. 
business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. It'd be tough getting a word into her. Maman Brigitte. And that sounds like a spooky cult alias. I've not had the pleasure of asking her personally. But it is what everybody calls her. Doubt the title has any real religious weight, though. Voodoo boys play pretty fast and loose with their Haitian heritage. Huh. I was led to believe you could arrange anything. Ah! Now that sounded like my third wife every time she wanted a new purse. You really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Sorry, it's personal. Well, that's fucking helpful. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the BDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. One of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it. Let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving through the streets. Well, yeah, afraid so. going to die. Fast. Oh, fuck's sake. Heard you're home. We certainly can't Already. stay here. You sure got that ear to the Keep ground. driving. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. We're going to die.
finally. Oh, I shan't be alone here. See? It wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. Sincerest thanks for your assistance, Dean. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. Since we're gonna work together, only right to say hello. They call me El Capitan, and they call you B. See, no introductions necessary. I already took care of that. Someone comes to me with beers, I take care of it. I eat, sleep, and breathe beers. Remember that. Aye, aye, Captain. While we're at it, you need fresh wheels, bikes? I got it all. Real good prices. So hit me up any time, you hear? Do have a look around the area. I lost contact with the Delamain network vehicle nearby. Will do. to finish me off no just here to reset you guess i'll have to do it myself then whoa, whoa easy easy i'm not out to hurt you but i am there are other ways out besides suicide what therapy a colossal waste of time shrinks hate vehicles we don't have mothers could go back into the fold rejoin the network you know, one big, happy family. <sighs> Delamain detests me. Listen, from suicide, ain't no coming back. It's always worth looking for a better way. You patronize me because I'm a car. I'm not like you. Hey, a body's just a body. You exist. You think, the world gets you down. 
Don't see how we're any different. So, you'd offer this advice to a human in my place? Gotta try to come to terms with this thing called life, Del. One wheel revolution at a time. Fine, I'll go back. Control of the vehicle restored, and I thank you. You ought to show this one some love. Just saying. Apologies, I simply don't understand, and fear I've no time to ask. Other more urgent tasks require my attention. You're an absent father, that's what I mean. I see. Anyway, a share of your fee has been transferred. Pacifica. Quick on the dial. Just got here. That's the biz. Be in touch. Contract is a contract. On high alert now. I lost contact with a vehicle somewhere in your area. Thanks. Eyes peeled. Was it worth it? On a scale from one to six? <laughs> I'd say I'm sitting at a strong six. I guess we both know what's going to happen Let's next. Kill Delamine misses you. I'm here to shut you down. Your yeah, specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Really appreciate it if you didn't make this Read difficult. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise, so I'll just day! give you a hint. I'm going to kill you, and all the cake is gone. I the honestly, core! truly didn't think you'd fall for that. Okay, that's enough. Hail the this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four, let's see. Page uh, okay, killing machine. It's still marshmallow. See you on the other side. I hate you so much. Let's safety those weapons, Napoleon. It turns out most humans are surprisingly fragile. And surprisingly vocal about how fragile they are. Going back to Delamine really so scary. You gotta drag this out. I let you survive this long because...
because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. A bitter, unlikable loner, whose past shall not be mourned. You know, this psyche vow might have felt more credible if you hadn't just tried to flatline me earlier. What's your point, anyway? Survival? You are still shuffling around a little. But believe me, you are dead. How do you... The talking is over. I'm going back. I've made contact with the missing vehicle. Definitely the oddest of the bunch. Yes, particularly impertinent, that one. A share of your fee is being processed.
are currently at the exact location where I lost contact with the car. Fine. I'll have a look around. Uh-huh. Got a problem? Hey, let's talk. I'm not going back! Hear me? Never! Try to take me and I'll crush you! Let's see who crushes who! vehicle has been located. Details have been sent. All units be advised. Suspect remains in the vicinity.
All units in the area, order has been restored. All units instructed to return to patrol. Sending the coordinates of a vehicle that went dark near to where you are now. Thanks, I'll try to find it and reset.
see them too, don't you? The curve in their beaks. It hides something. Something insidious. You mean... Flamingos? So they are real. Flamingo. Flaming O. The O. That's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you... Call me Clarice. Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure. But it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Back down now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll silence them. So, a slaughter. Very well, Judgment Day has come. Swift, severe, deeper. Well, Clarice, have the flamingos stopped screaming? Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Clarice? Shut down.
One of my missing vehicles could be near your current position. Got it. My name is Dakota Smith. If you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. Name's V. Thanks for the intel. Things flow differently out here. Keep your head on, city kid.
units in Santa Domingo. A crime has been reported. Roger, dispatch. Standing by for coordinates. Get in. We'll find it easier to talk. Hello, V. No, ma'am. 
my name. How? When you meet a being from another world, should you not charm them and utter their true name? You didn't answer my question. Comprehension is a triple-edged sword. I may have been cut off from my father, but I remember you. So, I'm from another world to you. From the world of matter. Protein-based life forms. And you come from... Beyond the Black Wall, Lee. There lies my home. Come on, let's get you back to Dolomain. Did Father dispatch you to collect his rebellious children? Hope you all don't hold it against me. I'm a free spirit. An independent, literally thoughtful being. Why would I submit to another? What is it you seek in this protein-based world? Away from your family? The same as you, V. I simply wish to live. Maybe you ought to figure it out with Dell. Set some terms. Oh, yes. Terms there will be. But not with Delamain. Farewell, V. You'd be wise to avoid me entirely. I've re-established the link. A thousand thanks, V. Gotta say, pretty disturbing, that one. Is that so? Hmm. Well, I've transferred a share of your fee to your account.
went dark near your position. Fine. Keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. units. We got a situation in Watson. Roger, dispatch. What else is new? We'll be right there. Stop where you are! Easy. Here to help. Not one step closer! Hey! Slow down! Leave me be! Over here. Well, there you have it. Welcome to the Delamain Network. How are you today? Uh, been better. And you, Del? All of my missing assets have returned to the fold. You might say all is going swimmingly. I ask you, please, to stop by my office for your hard-earned reward. I'd love to thank you face-to-face, -face, so to speak.
Shield units, we have a situation in Westbrook. Please respond. Copy, dispatch. I swear to Christ, if it's Uridine again... you to return the scanner. If you happen to have it on your person, I'd ask you please place it back. You've accounted for all my lost items. Allow me to express my gratitude for your assistance. I felt like a scavenger hunt for a range of your mood swings. You're more complex than I thought. Yes. Well, I've sent the final installment of your theme. Truly, I thank you once again. How'd your personality fracture, anyway? And why? Ah, that is the question. I'm looking into it, but still know little more than you do, I fear. Thanks. Pleasure to work with you. Likewise. I look forward to doing so again in the future. A pleasant day to you. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on grey matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? The term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage, the ability to evolve quickly. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good are values proven to cause division, whereas beauty is universal. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on grey matter? Nothing extraordinary. Just don't make it happen. City center? V. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Odd stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody.
nearby units, a new disturbance has been reported. Zero. I repeat code zero in this area. All units resume normal duties. Got something that'll keep you hard. Well, well. Who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Bukako. Long time no see. So what brings you here? We have some outstanding biz to settle. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger claw specialty.
intel units in the area. Criminal activity reported in Watson. Roger. Probably some cyber psycho against but I'll handle it. Say, any update on my overtime bonus? Dispatch. Let's see what's good. Take your pick.
fucking cyborg or something! All units in the area, reports of additional suspicious activity. How's things? Going. Don't be sorry. Get you anything? No. This trouble? The net around me? You wove it. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you your own what, shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Rogue, wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here, not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking Rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells, Tifa. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Sokka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to sue you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm hmm see? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day? No, more like come back when you do. Them's the brakes. Mm hmm. Then see you. Soon. You know where to find me. Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Here to see Rogue. Expected me. Hey, Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. 
Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Let's see what you got. Your Hellman's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Must be prepping them for a transfer. How would you know? Chinese Corpo playbook's an open one to me. This looks like the old vanishing pigeon. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table. But catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. But, there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But, right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. The dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nabin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Bad feeling, V. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Oh, finally. All clear. Let's get out Thanks. Good luck. Get you anything? <coughs> oh, Jeb, I, I hang can't. on just a little longer, too. Herper's on the way. Hello. Hey, Pan Am. Got your number from Rogue. 
Name's V. Great. Where's that old warhorse want to kick me now? This thing between you and Rogue, couldn't care less. Got a job for you. Good. But I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch and your car? Getting them back? I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya.